I think instead of touring in uh, Asia and going to Taiwan, you need to build up upper body strength because you know a lot of other guys are taller than he is. He's going to get uh, knocked around. So. <coughs> You know, the Knicks stole him away from Golden, uh, Golden State. Golden you know? State, yeah. Yeah, right. We're from Golden State. Well, that, was a, that was a good deal, though. Oh, not for us. <laughs> yeah, not but, for us in the Bay Area. <laughs> yeah, but for him, they, it was. You know, he, he it had, was. He, 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 there were too many, too much competition there for him in, at, at, at really? Golden State. So, what was the first thing uh, Jeremy said to you when you met him, or what? What you said to him? You remember? I, I don't remember. You know, he's pretty quiet. Yeah, yeah. he's very religious too. Yeah, he, he, yeah. yeah. He, he loves to go fishing. I understand uh, you're a big fisherman. Oh. Are you? Well, I'm a, I'm a backpacker. You're a backpacker. <laughs> yeah. Wow, backpacker. Yeah. <clears throat> All right. I think this. Probably. We've got we've <coughs> got uh, good fishing around here. Uh, you do. See the bowling ball in the back, and uh, yeah, inventory cage. Okay, so this could, uh, could be the inventory for, for all your stamina for for, for golf. Uh, well, actually, we don't have the golf clubs here. <laughs> yeah. Got in his uh, trunk. <coughs> you got them in your, your got trunk. Got them in my trunk. <laughs> yeah. So, but uh, are you happy with this? That's okay. That's okay. Yeah. Well. Okay. So this is. Uh, just a few others. But, uh, okay, so I didn't want to show too much of the barbed wire, but it's an indication that the barbed wire represents part of the history for Japanese Americans. Okay. okay. <coughs> well, you know, but now I have to convince your wife. <laughs> yeah, right. <coughs> yeah. That's because uh, I don't know if you know this, but uh, <coughs> on Saturday I uh, helped to organize to uh, about. 200, 250 yeah. uh, okay. Chinese and Asian Americans yeah, right. like to go in spite. Yeah. Because I said to myself that after 145 years, enough is enough. All right. Right. <coughs> they didn't include the Chinese uh, when they had the historic photograph that was taken 145 years ago. But after 1882, when they enacted the Chinese Exclusion Act, they brought in Japanese to replace the Chinese laborers. So the Japanese uh, worked. Uh, laying tracks and uh, so forth, post 1882. Right. Yeah, both here in the United States and also in Canada. Okay. Until 24. <laughs> Until 24. And, and then they barred all of us right. yeah, from entering. Right. <clears throat> and uh, we, we couldn't testify, we, uh, we couldn't naturalize and uh, so forth. Uh, so uh, it, it's a, a small step on a long journey for recognition for Asian Pacific Americans. And, uh, Said that uh, Chinese Americans and Japanese Americans yeah, have history with the railroad. So, uh, uh, Jeanette, uh, is she your sister-in-law? Sister-in-law. <coughs> sister-in-law. Uh, remember me when I came in 2002. There was a convention of uh, organization Chinese Americans. Uh, so they wanted to give me this award, a Pioneer Award. OCA. You know? Yeah, OCA. <coughs> I said number one. Um, I don't think of myself as a pioneer. You know, my hair hasn't turned color yet. <laughs> but they insisted on doing that. I said, well, I will go on one condition. If they uh, take the uh, people in the convention up to uh, Golden Spike, because I wanted to try to assemble as big a, a, a <coughs> group as possible. And the park ranger 12 years ago assured me at the time that I, yesterday, uh, what, today's Monday? No, Saturday. Saturday yeah. yeah. Uh, I'm getting a little senile. <laughs> but, uh, <clears throat> it was the largest group of uh, Chinese and Asian Pacific Americans, including uh, uh, Jeanette uh, and uh, Judge Ray Uno was there also. Okay. So uh, he was there. I don't know if you got a chance to see anything in the Salt Lake Tribune. Yeah, but they had I saw the, the picture. Oh, you saw it? Okay, so I, I'm quoted there as saying that this is a. Uh, uh, photographic act of justice. So right, I, I right. kind of made it up right on the spot. <laughs> well, that's good for you. So that's what uh, uh, I hope that uh, <clears throat> in the future, both the mayor of Salt Lake City and the governor uh, will show up 
at, at least at the press conference, because uh, we had a press conference in uh, the state capitol, and it was a little too, they were a little, their uh, schedule was a little too busy. I, I, I'm hoping that this is, you know, uh, a step in the, the right direction and that the state will uh, pay more attention to Asian Pacific Americans, you know, like yourself uh, as well as myself. Uh, two months ago, I was in uh, Colorado and I f photographed the last remaining Congressional uh, Medal recipient, oh, yeah. Joe Sakata. Okay, he's 93. So uh, uh, I wanted to photograph him with his uh, Medal of Honor, uh, uh, hold, holding the Medal of Honor. So it was in a Starbucks that he held it up oh, and he I had a oxygen tubes, you know. Oh, no, okay. <clears throat> well, he, yeah, it helps him, you know. Uh, so he, he needs it every so often. So it was in a Starbucks and I photographed So he's holding up. Uh, he's got the uh, baseball cap, says, you know, Congressional Medal of Honor. And then we went over to the cemetery, because they have a cemetery there dedicated to all the uh, uh, Nisei uh, who perished. Okay. So, and then they also gave him a, a flag, probably about the size of this uh, gate over here. Oh, wow. Right? And it's a light blue background. has 13 white stars for the original colonies. And it was fortuitous that they uh, bought, he bought the... Uh, the flag because it was too sunny on one side, so we used the flag to block out the sun so I could photograph him. <laughs> so that was probably the only use of uh, the Congressional uh, Medal of Flag that was ever put into use. <laughs> but uh, it was a real pleasure. Um, I think maybe Chris, you know, has some uh, questions for you. Are you willing to uh, handle a few questions? Do you have time? Well, yeah, I guess. My boss doesn't seem to be too. Are you hurry to finish this stuff up? Okay. Let me get, <coughs> get position. Oh. All right. I think Carol wants to.